All right, first pie guy here. Got a little box here. Got myself a, another case. Comes with a fan for a raspberry pie. This is a nice case. I have uh, several of them. This is what it looks like when it's complete. Includes heat sinks, a fan. So that's what we're gonna build today. So it comes with a little screwdriver. The sad thing is it doesn't come with instructions. So that's the problem. But we have them two pieces, hardware, the fan, the heat sinks for the pie. Let me go ahead and get some of this situated. I'll be right back. All right. <clears throat> I went ahead and took the protective stuff off of these. Organized my screws a little bit. So what we need to do is, first thing is, uh, I'm gonna work on the bottom here. So put the small screw up through. Tighten down the standoff, so we'll go do that with all four of them here. And then we'll come back and Tighten them up here. I'm going to use another screwdriver other than the one that came with it. Get a little bit better grip on it. But I'm just going to tighten these up. You don't want to over tighten them because you might break the plastic. So, snug them. Alright, so that's that. That'll hold the pie. So now we'll, we can go ahead and we'll go ahead and do the big standoffs if we want. So we'll screw them down. And this, uh, this case can be found on uh, Amazon for like $9. Free shipping. Free shipping if... Uh, if you're a prime member so not a bad deal it's a nice little case works out nice it's uh, pretty cool so worth the money so we're just going to go through and tighten these up here so All right, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and put these uh, heat sinks on. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Got the heat sinks on. The big one goes there. The small one goes right there. Then the copper one goes there underneath the pie. So now we'll just line this up with the uh, SD card side of the pie. And put it right down on there, like so. Then we're going to use these nuts and uh, tighten them up. Might have been a little easier to do the standoffs on the pie first, which I should have done that, but. We will. Either way, works out. I'll tighten these up later.
Do 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 do. Yeah, I guess I should have done it the other way. But, we got it. Just have to be careful. All right, let me get the thing situated for the fan, and I'll be right back. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and put the fan on. So I'm going to grab my screws here and uh, grab the little guard here. Put the guard through there like such. Then we're going to put that through. Like that. And put this note on. And we'll do that to the wrist. Don't give you very much thread left out to get it stored. But it does work. And all we need to do, now my dog's barking. I will just take a little pair of needle nose here and just snug these up a little bit. Don't want to overkill, but we'll just snug them up a little bit like that so they stay in place. So now that that's done, we're going to connect this to the 5 volt in the ground. So, we're going to go like that. Just make sure you have it plugged in on the uh, 5 in the ground. And all we got to do yet is take this and put it on here like that. And then we're going to put these nuts on. One on four. Tighten them up, but other than that, there you go. You got yourself a case with a fan. And uh, that's a whole solid piece right there. Got a little gap in between there. Got your display and camera cutouts. Your cutout for your pins there. There you go. Thanks for watching. I put a link in the description for this case. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more videos.